Hey there, filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back with another episode of the DTM Show. Here today we've got uh, Hungry Howie's on the show. I don't know if we've ever had these guys on the show before. Uh, I used to live really close to these guys, had them all the time. And now I'm a little bit further. It's maybe like a 15, 20 minute drive to get to a Hungry Howie's from here. And um, I really stopped going because I stopped carrying the taco pizza. Now up until recently you could find such item on their website. And uh, but and all the Hungry Howie's around here in my area, they wouldn't carry it. They said the, uh, the taco meat just was too expensive for them to keep on making it and carrying it every day. So in this place here, it seems that we've got a, a bacon double cheeseburger pizza. So we're going to be checking this out today. Um, you really have to dig to find this thing on their website. Um, you, got, you don't just find it directly off their website either. You've got to like, go through a Google search for this item in particular, and it'll take you to a sub page. Uh, this is the bacon cheddar cheeseburger on their page. When you walk in the restaurant, it's the bacon double cheeseburger. And they're saying it's ground beef, bacon, cheddar, and mozzarella cheese. And of course, uh, in the restaurant, however, on the menu, it's that plus the bacon plus onions. And let me show you what we got inside this box. Because I asked them for no onions, and it turns out that we've got onions all over this son of a bitch. So I'm going to show it to you first. And then uh, we'll look at a slice, whatnot, and I'm going to pick the onions off. We're going to give it a go. Here we go. The uh, bacon double cheeseburger pizza from Hungry Howie's. Bam, there you go, right there. Check all that out. Get you in a little bit closer here. Do this without knocking bongs and shit over. Right, there you go. Yep. Not a bad spread. I mean, it looks good. It smells good. But, yeah. I mean, these aren't even, like, sautéed onions. No buttery, no nothing. This is just, like, white fucking diced onions. Ugh. Other than that, though, it looks like there's a pretty good helping of bacon on here, a good helping of the uh, the ground beef, maybe that's seasoned. And we do see our cheddar mozzarella mix going on. I did ask him for a butter cheese crust on this. Of course, uh, Hungry Howie is one of the first guys to offer flavored crusts. Man, I'm having trouble. Looks like she didn't cut it all the way. Like one chick working this place by herself. She's working the register. She's making the food. Working the phone, doing everything. No AC, door propped open. I mean, fucking A, Hungry Howie's. Give that chick a raise. No wonder she fucking put onions on here. She's probably delirious from the goddamn heat. It's like 100 degrees here in Florida. All right, so here's a slice I'm going in on. Um, I already picked most of the onions off of this, actually. But, uh, yeah, you can see how thick our dough is, you know, compared to how much toppings is going on. See the bottom of this uh, typical, it almost looks like the uh, frozen kind of crust. Like they're just pulling it out and just topping it, throwing it through a conveyor belt oven is what it looks like. I don't know. I'm not in their kitchen. They might have a big ass oven. She might have pressed this out by hand. I have no idea, but I doubt it looking at that right there. All right, here we go. Down the hatch with our bacon double cheeseburger pizza from Hungry Howie's. Real bacon. That's nice. You know, I can even see like fatty bits and stuff going on. But... Mostly it's meaty. It's got like a regular, you know, breakfast bacon, streaky bacon kind of flavor going on. There's plenty of that seasoned beef on there, but it just kind of melds in with the bacon since it's so flavorless. So I got like salt going on with the with the hamburger, ground beef. You know, the bacon is much more flavorful. So it just seems like an extension of that, honestly. The two cheese blend going on, the mozzarella and the cheddar, really can't tell. It just seems like cheese at the end, you know. Still a standard issue, Hungry Howie's sauce. It's like a, a zesty, sweet kind of pizza sauce. Like real herby. Damn, looks like even a piece of chicken might have found its way onto here. It's not bad, but it's not a new flavor by any means. This tastes exactly like the uh, the Meat Lover's Pizza, I think it is, from uh, Pizza Hut. Or maybe it's the Meat Supreme. Whatever it is. The one that they have that has all the meats. The bacon, the pepperoni, the sausage, the hamburger. It's got like all that on there. That's what this tastes like. The mixture of the greasy hamburger and the bacon, along with like a real thick, kind of doughy, buttery flavored crust. Yeah, that's what's doing it. Let me go ahead and nail off this uh, crust here, and then we'll throw a rating on it. You know, I'd say that she forgot to put the butter cheese crust on there if I didn't see like all of the Parmesan cheese all around the outside of the box and some of it's still attached, but yeah, almost flavorless. It doesn't taste very bacon cheeseburger like though. You know, there's no uh, mustard flavor, no ketchup flavor, just the pizza sauce flavor, and it's like nothing like ketchup at all. There's no pickle flavor going on here. It really just tastes like a meat lover's pizza. So I would say all of that combined, wheat crust, 
not really cheeseburger flavor, tons of onions after we asked for no onions, a fucking piece of chicken fat. Now I can't see myself ordering this again, and I honestly I can't see myself even finishing this pizza. Not even the slice that I started. So the Hungry Howie's bacon double cheeseburger pizza, yeah, I'm gonna give this a two out of five. All right, one more item before we slide out of here. Let's make this a two for why don't we? Since that was such a bad showing for a pizza. Every nowadays everybody's got like their own bread, cheesy bread, garlic bread crazy bread, you name it. Everybody's got bread. So Hungry Howie's, here we go. We got the, uh, the I think it's the three cheeser Howie bread, then there's just regular Howie bread and sauce, which is what's supposed to be inside of here. So let's crack this open and check out our uh, Howie bread with sauce, all right? So bam, there you go. That's what you get. As you can see it does have you know, the Parmesan, the cheese stuff going across the top. Uh, most likely it's got a strong garlic flavor so we know you know this is garlic bread it's not just regular old dough with a little bit of cheese on top then over here we do have a container of marinara sauce alright just gonna rip off an end piece here I gotta tell you right off the bat this feels a little wet alright so there we go that's what you get that's a close up inside alright so it's cooked well done and browned on the outside alright here we go yeah, the inside is cooked well done, but the outside it's a little torched flavor, you know, a little burnt tasting. Let me throw it in this marinara sauce here. I'm sure this is just their uh, standard issue pizza sauce. It's cold to the touch though, that's weird. Yeah, that's just their pizza sauce. It appears that they uh, keep it refrigerated. Alright, not bad, besides being you know, a little overcooked, slightly. Um, got a nice garlic flavor, a nice cheesy flavor, um, very buttery, uh, to the point it's like buttery greasy, you know, but still pretty good and way better than the pizza that we just saw. Um, I would definitely get this over and over again. Uh, it's not like the greatest thing, it's just fucking bread, honestly, but yeah, I would definitely get this again. This is on point. I'm giving this a four out of five. <laughs> All right, so there you have it. It's the uh, bacon double cheeseburger and the uh, cheesy bread with sauce here on the GTM Show. Give them a try if you want. I'm Mr. Dirty. It's the GTM Show. Don't forget, you can buy knucklehead shirts and hoodies down in the description. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the Real Mr. Dirty. And as always, get out of here and go have a rotten day.